So last week we have learned that parallel line and perpendicular line. Correct, Vicky? Do you still remember? Okay. So Kelvin, when we have uh, to a linear equation, it is looking like y equals mx plus b, right? So with two lines, if one of them is y equals 2x plus 3, another one is y equals 2x plus 5. So basically, because the m equals to each other, so they are parallel to each other. Okay, so that means if two linear equation, the m is the same, so they are same to each other. So they are parallel to each other, okay? So now let's take a look at the perpendicular uh, equation. So line, line, line. So if we have a y equals one over two x plus five, another one equals y negative two x minus seven. So these two lines, Kelvin, Kelvin is parallel, sorry, perpendicular to each other. Perpendicular because it's one over two times negative two equals negative one. Correct. So that is a basic. Oh, what? so the two things times together has to equal one. Negative one. Why does that have to equal negative one? Half x times why, negative why, two equals. Why can it? Why can it equal one? Why? Why can it be like, uh, one over two times two? It's negative two, Kelvin. No, but like if it's two, then they're not perpendicular to each other. Do they have to? Does it have to be negative one? Yeah. Oh. Only when they are equals to negative one, so then they're perpendicular to each other. What if it's one and negative one? One and negative one times together equals negative one. So these two lines are perpendicular to each other. Ooh. Mm -hmm. So we have learned something over there, okay? So they want to make, if L1 has a slope of M1, L2 has a slope of M2, and L3 has a slope of M3, right? And Oliver, you why don't you have a picture? I don't know. Hmm, your picture, your, 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 Okay, Oliver, I can see you. Okay. Okay, so let's take a look at this one. So Kevin, you can see M1, M2, and M3, right? So we want to make L1 parallel to M2. So basically the M2 must be the same as M1, right? And M3 need to perpend perpendicular to M1. So basically it's negative three over two. Okay, backwards, one over four and one over four. Get it, everybody? So this is something uh, we learned it. So this is very easy, right? So, so let's take a look at this one, okay? So we're going to, when the number is like numbers, nobody's having problems because you can just do what you find out the M, right? But when the number became something like a variable, some students just became a little bit confused, right? Determine whether the line passing through the first pair of the points is parallel, perpendicular, or neither to the line passing through the second pair of the points. So basically, this is having this is line one, and this is line two. Understand, Vicky? Okay. So when we find out the m one equals what equals a minus b over b minus a, correct, Kelvin? Because it's y two minus y one divided by x two minus x one equals negative one. So let's see, M2. Kevin, understand? Okay, so is, this one is- Isn't that the slope? Isn't that the slope? Yeah, two over C divided by D over two. Are you trying to, are you trying to calculate the slope here? Yeah, I'm calculating the slope because the only slope is matters, right? So I'm going to times two for both left side and right sides, top and bottom. So C, sorry. C minus two D over D minus two C. So that this one equals one, 
obviously no. So they are not perpendicular, parallel to each other. So it is neither. Get it, everybody? Miki? Miki, number J, can you tell me what is M for the number one? You don't know. Yeah, they Vicky can't said, Vicky said that she don't know. Because Vicky just told it to me. Vicky knew that he was in the room. You have seen him in of not listening to whatever we're doing. You think you have the rights to do something like that? This is line one, this is line two. I want you to tell me the slope of line one for this data I have already given it to you. Andy know nothing because I think you don't like this feeling. Okay, the only thing can avoid this feeling is just to concentrate and tell yourself to stop whatever you're doing right now, like chatting with somebody else. Okay, so Andy, could you please tell me how to do the calculate the slope of L1? Um, like, so the first one, because... Oh, yeah. Wait, oh, it, it's, it's, um, I think it's zero. zero? Uh, because it's like um so this is drive, y2. Drive. This is a one, right? So a, a yeah. so this is y2, this is y1. So it's a minus b divided by b minus a. Get it? Yeah, so, it's something like yeah. this. So, no, not, no, this is not zero, negative, this is negative one. Oh, negative one, same thing. Correct? Oh, Andy? Yeah, negative one. Okay. So, M2, slope equals Y2 minus Y1 divided by X2 minus X1. Correct? Jason? Uh. Okay. So, now, Vicky, I want you to try it again because I think right now you understand. So using y2 minus y1. So can you give me the equation for the uh, slope number two? Huh? So we have a pair of, so AB is a point and BA is another point, right? So this one is y and this one is x, right? right? So that's why it's B minus A divided by A minus B, correct? So if we now have two points is CD and negative D and negative C. So this is Y, this is X. So the slope is Y2 minus Y1. So D minus negative C over C minus negative D, correct, Kevin? Kevin, Kevin. Kevin. Okay, so Vicky equals D plus C over C plus D, right? So they equals one. So negative one and one. So carry law. Sorry, Oliver, because they times, so M1 times M2 equals negative one times one equals negative one. So they are what? Perpendicular to each other. Correct? Yeah, Kevin's me and me only. Kevin, the Liana. Omelia, ma. Milk, that's a Kelvin. You see that? No, cannot see you, Liana. No, Kelvin, milk. Wait, I'm gonna like move somewhere because the Wi Fi is so bad. Okay, like, higher, higher. Oh. okay, so now let's take a look at. 
Let's take a look at number six, number seven, number eight, and number nine, okay? So these are some other questions that is very important, okay? Show that the point A, B, C are the vertices of a right triangle. So everybody, so Vicky, when we are seeing this paired order and Jason, Andy, Elaine, the very importancy is if you see the paired order, you need to put them into the paired order system. Okay, so let's take a look at this one. We're putting them in the coordinate system. So negative three. So that's negative three, zero, right? So this is A. And one, two, one, two. So that's B. And three, negative two. So three and the negative two. Okay, so I'm going to connect them. So my question is everybody, how to prove they are A, how to prove that they are a right triangle, okay? So there are two ways, okay, everybody? There are two uh, ways. Uh, the, uh, before what before no, we no. learn the M slope thing, so I'm going to put this one here, okay? So Vicky, why I'm putting the paired order here? Because Pythagoras it's- Pythagoras theorem. I'll show the Pythagoras theorem. 对,很好,这个Kelvin说了,在没有学那个以前,我们可以用Pythagorean theorem做,对不对? 但是现在我们已经学过了,是不是只要证明AB和BC垂直, if we can prove AB and BC are perpendicular to each other, that means yes. this is form a right triangle, correct? Kelvin? Yeah. Okay, so now, how to prove AB perpendicular BC? Basically, we just find out slope AB, and we find a slope BC. If they times together, Elaine equals what? Equals? Negative one. Very good, equals negative one, then they are form a right triangle. Vicky, Okay, so now this question became find out the slope of AB. Hala MAB is mature, because we have a, B, S, a paired order. So this is X value. This is Y value, negative three, zero, and one and a two. So basically they are zero minus two over negative three minus one equals negative two over negative four. Kevin, understand? Equals half. What do you John Kelvin or Kevin? Kevin. Oh, now Kelvin, Kelvin, you can tell me the slope BC is Slope BC equals slope BC equals R R minus R R minus, minus R, R R minus negative R mm -hmm. over one minus three. Very good. Well, I'm not sure. I'm crazy. Three negative two. Then oh, negative two. Okay, hold on. You can M A B times M B C equals half times negative two exactly equals negative one. So that's why AB is perpendicular to BC. That's why triangle ABC is a right triangle. Get it, Andy? Get it? No, Andy? <laughs> get it, Kelvin? Get it, Kevin? Get it, Elaine? And get it, I'll carry it all. <laughs> okay, so let's take a look at this one, okay? Show that the point A, B, C, D are vertices of a parallelogram. So again, when you see those, when you see those paired order, so first of all, Vicky, Andy, Jason, I want them to be put into a coordinate system. So negative three and one, B is, so negative three and one. See, I always put the, the paired order near the point, right? So B is negative two and a negative two. And C is two and negative one. And the D is one, two. Okay, 
are the vertices of a parallelogram. So how we do it? Please connect them. Okay, so you're gonna find out if I can prove that AD is parallel to BC and AB is parallel to CD, then ABCD is a parallelogram. Correct, everybody? Kevin, correct? Okay, so Kevin, not Calvin. Kevin, can you tell me the slope of AD and the slope of BC? And I would like to hear from uh, Jason, can you tell me the slope of AB and the slope of CD? And you know what, Oliver, you have the ability, okay? 你们所有的人把答案发给Oliver. Okay, Jason, but I fucking Oliver. Uh, Kevin, yeah, but I fucking Oliver. Oliver, I can't even so the two put it. Rugo, Niman, so do it. And how Oliver show Niman, so so la. Now, that's how Oliver da pig. Niman, you don't da pig. Oh, so so in the fucking time. They don't fucking Oliver. Wait, what's what's AD? Who's Oliver? Oh, AD, AD. I'm doing AD. AD, BC is for me. What do you want to do? Make it not so. 就这样子啊,所有的人做好,全部发给Oliver。不是Oliver。就是另外一个Carrie罗。你们太... 那个 guys, I'm totally Oliver. The nigga is Andy. Ha 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 Bum bum you want me to like I suck at this. which one parallel or like yeah or like, yeah. no but like do you want me to say parallel or neither or like the uh, parallelogram can you parallel they are push up perpendicular you drop at him and you central I wrote him in the slope just younger in the just look what you know I mean you want to do it so I just said that you all of the same what I just sent you all of the same understand Kevin you when you can a d her bc that really kind of what the top kind of what the two so a d her bc was that really much so A, B, and C, D are not here. If it's a parallelogram, it should be parallelogram. And these two 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 should Yo, I forgot to put a mark. Yo. Bro, I can't do math. Wait, oh, why mind, is no one send the, send the answer to me? Because you're so bad at it. <laughs> There's no one send the answer to me. Yo, how? Wait, wait. I know which one is you. That's the funny thing. Who did I send it to? 
Like, you can literally just click Oliver's carry little host instead of the person that said what. And your plan is foolproof. Yeah, you can just uh right click <laughs> Oliver's inventor and the chat. Oh, oh okay, gotcha. I don't know what to do. Oh. Pro gamer move. That's Oliver. Most. <laughs> Who's this then? Oh my gosh, Jason. What, did I send it to you? No, you know, I gotta change my name. Exactly. I, I That's why I stopped. Oh no. I swear, if I sent a wrong one, so I'm annoying. gonna go. I agree. <laughs> Oliver's name back again. Wait, Oliver just changed the name to S. Jason. What? Wait, my, my name is S. Jason. Kevin, Kevin, Kevin. I can't, I can't find Oliver. Oliver's okay. Oh, I found Oliver. Yeah. <laughs> Most. Okay, Oliver, Wait, the J has to be capital. The J, the J needs to be capital. Oliver, you do it well. No, that's you. You don't know who it is. Ah. When the teacher comes to your house, he will beat you. Ah. I like that. I'm going to let one person send. Uh, there is someone who sees what I sent. What do you think? Uh, I I saw that that you just sent it to me. <laughs> 不是我说有人看见我发的是什么了吗？我刚刚。It's one one over four. It's one over four. Your answer is one over four. Yeah. 不对，那个不是我发的。I did it right, I think. Yeah. Okay, Oliver, 有多少人做对的？我现在来听一下。啊，那没有人看见的话，那么我我就发对了。嗯哼。五。I, I think I said it to the wrong guy. Wait, hold on. Oliver, you said it already. Is is yeah? Shaiza. Wait, wait. I sent it to is Jason. Is that Jason? <laughs> Which one? <laughs> no, it's the is Jason with like lowercase J. Oh, actually, oh, I sent it to the I sent it to the wrong guy. Oh wait, let me check the chat again. I forgot it. I did it right. Kel sent me AD equals one quarter, which is Kel sent me two things, and one of them was says everything is one quarter, which is wrong. Only well, he also sent me AD equals one. Fourth, which is correct. Okay. And, yeah. uh, and the uh, the other people. Other. Let me check the other people. Um, so Carrie Lua host got <laughs> got A D and B C correct, but the Are you kidding me? How fast? Wrong. 我我怎么了？是你在画吗？呀，我在。不是我在画啊！我<笑>我说我冤枉了，有人把名字改成我了。呀，我在画。Guys, not me. Seriously, not me. Can't possibly be here. Oh my god. 
，昨天还弄那儿那，阿里呗，你听我说，阿里呗刚说有几个人做对了。Kels got only one thing right, and then Carrie Lo Host got half of them right. Who is Carrie Lo Host? Yeah, other Carrie Lo Host who is there's no other Carrie Lo Host. And now changed to Vicky Jin. Mm-hmm. And did I get it right at least? And is Andy got it correct? Huh? You was Andy. 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 <laughs> yeah, I think that's Andy. M A D, okay. M A D 等于什么？二减。It's not me. 负三等于 one over four. 对呀 ，M A D 对的。M B C 呢？不是。负一减十二。哎呀，我要。Wait, mom makes man on a mission. That's mom. One over four. 啊 ，one over four. 对呀，这个两个都是 one over four. 对的呀，这个对的呀，所以他们两个是平行的，对不对？好，我们再来看 A B. A B 等于一减负二，除以负三减负二，等于三除以负一，等于负三。这里呢，二减负一除以一减二，等于三除以负一，等于负三。你看，都是负三，所以也对了。OK， 那谁是做对的？告诉我一下。I got it right, but I don't know what I'm saying. Because you didn't send, you didn't send to Oliver, is it? I don't know. 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 So what is trapezoid, everybody? What is trapezoid? Trapezoid 两条线是平行的，就只要两条变平行好了。所以你一定要把这个画出来，就知道 A 在哪里，负一负二 ，B 在四和一。二了。第九题。OK， 这是 A， 这是 B， 然后 C 在三和四。那 Jason， 你又开始打字干嘛？然后 C 是三四啊 ，C 是三四 ，D 是负三四。对，在这儿，对不对？所以你把它们连起来，你看，你看一下你就知道了嘛。肯定要选 M C B 和 M A D， 看到？所以 Jason， sorry， Vicky， 还有 Andy， 还有 Kelvin， Kevin， 如果你们不把这个图画出来，你不知道算哪个 slope。Understand， Kevin？ OK， 所以一定要把图画出来，你就知道要算哪个了。对呀、啊、，no swearing， OK， 我也不知道谁在说，反正都是 Vicky， Vicky 好可怜啊！<笑>哎，不是，不是，我自己都不知道哪个是我了。我现在发消息好是老是发到发给我自己。I think that real Vicky is innocent。对呀、啊、，OK， <笑> Vicky stop chatting。Vicky 说， Vicky 说， Vicky stop chatting。OK， Oh my God。Okay, 我们再来看一下 number five. Okay, number sorry, number seven. So let's just take a look at number seven questions. 这个是 homework 吗 ？William wants. Yeah, I think it was. Yeah, it's it's homework. So let's take a look at number seven. Okay, supply and demand is always related to price. What does it mean? 我跟大家说一件事情，你就懂了。Vicky 跑到一个店里面去，看到一条裙子一千块钱，这裙子太漂亮，再漂亮她也不会买的。One thousand dollars. 但是 Vicky 跑到一个店里面，看到这个裙子十块钱，这裙子哪怕看起来很普通，啊，十块钱 ，it's not bad， 刚好我我我手里有个十块钱，那我买一条裙子，让我自己开心一下。So the supply and demand is always related to price。但是你这个只看到 supply 的呃不对 demand 对不对？那我们现在来讲讲 supply 的问题。你看这个 Jason 和 Kelvin 都听好，这跟 economics 有关系。好，那有些小朋友，有些人就说了。那既然所有的 customer 都会 tend to buy more on the cheaper stuff, doesn't mean that people is willing to 
make more cheaper products. C V yes, 对 Tend to. 老师有一个冒充我的人说，他才是 B K。OK， 不要理他，好好听老师上课啊。那是不是因为大部分的人都会去买便宜的东西？那是不是 the the company is going to make produce cheaper products? I'm going to ask you a very simple question, Kevin. And Kelvin, I want two of you think about it. Okay, how much money you can make out of a ten dollars product? 就算这个东西不要成本 ，you don't need to pay anything. The maximum you can make is ten dollars. Correct? No. Right, Kevin? 对呀、啊，你你一样东西，你就算没有成本，而且你无论再怎么便宜的东西，因为你都要 cost 的，对不对？ Correct. Okay. 就是你无论怎么样，你都需要。人家是因为这个东西只卖十块钱，也就是说你最多只能 make ten dollars out of it. Correct. 好了。Think about one thousand thing. Yes, you can go to wash. 爷爷，去吧，去吧，去吧。OK. 那如果你一千块钱的东西 ，Jason， 想想想看 ，Jason， 你干嘛反过来？你好烦。<笑>我我不想看到你倒着，你可以正过来吗？你好烦 ，OK。那 Jason 老师问你，如果一千块钱的东西，他哪怕只有百分之十的利润，他是不是也能 make one hundred dollars？ Yeah。干嘛？你烦死了！刚刚说完 Jason 那个，你你又有一个人反过来了，又有一个人倒过来，没完，像吊死鬼一样，开个反手。<笑> Okay, so let's take a look at this one. Let's take a look at this one. Okay, so let's take just, just 老师随便给你们讲一讲东西啊 Okay, so supply demand is always related to price. Suppose demand for a video game is forty five hundred units when the price is thirty dollars per unit and three thousand units when the price is forty per unit. 就是如果这个 video game 卖三十块钱一个的话，就会有四千五百个人来买。如果这个 price 是四十块钱一个 unit 的话，就只有三千块三千个人来买。为什么？因为贵了嘛，贵了就不会每个人都来买了，对不对？ Determine a linear equation related to the price unit sold. 什么意思？ So we want to have. So the price is we can say the price is thirty. Okay. So. Is times forty five hundred correct? That is the total, and the forty times three thousand. 但是这个值是什么 ？This is only based on what? Thirty. It based on the specific thing, but I want you to find out the linear equation. 有一个有一个式子。Okay, so with that calculation, then you can find out. If the price is fifty, and how much is the unit is going to? <coughs> Sorry. Jason, you're doing what? So let's take a look at this one. So how do we do it? So, for instance, if we have the sheet. So we can have thirty is x. Ah, yeah, 烦死了！哎，你们每次赶回来，我是谁都不知道是谁。Elin 最乖了，现在班里面除了 Kevin 和 Elin， 全都是 Vicky。哎呀，不行，全都赶回来，不然我要生气，我不上课了，我要去睡觉。Wait, how do you know which Vicky is which? I don't know. You don't. I don't know. Okay, I'll sleep for a while. You continue. Okay, so this So everybody, 换回来了吗 ？OK， 好
是 Jason 和 Andy 还是讨厌。Okay, so let's take a look at this one. So you have to understand, forty-five thousand is a unit, right? And the price is based on the unit. So that's why the price is y, and the unit is x. So basically, for this question, it's determining m and b. So we can have what? Y equals m x plus b. Correct, Elaine. So I can just plug in thirty equals m times forty five hundred plus b, and forty equals m times three thousand plus b. Okay, so you can just directly minus them. So negative ten equals one thousand and five hundred m. So m equals negative one over one fifty. Because what m equals what we can do that thirty equals negative one over one fifty times forty five hundred plus b. So thirty equals negative thirty plus b. So b equals sixty. So the equation is y equals sorry we can say price. So price equals negative one over one hundred fifty times unit plus sixty. Oliver, did you get it? <laughs> Dot, did you get it? Dot. I hope you. I hope you know I'm talking to you. Dot. <laughs> 也经常有些人啊，名字改了，都自己都不知道自己改什么。我在跟你说啊 ，Kevin， 你不改名就 dot 了吗 ？Okay, so understand everybody. Okay, so let's take a look at next one. Okay, determine the demand. So we know price equals negative one over fifty plus sixty. So determine if the price dropped to twenty five per unit. So twenty five, sorry, unit. Equals negative one over fifty unit plus sixty. So negative thirty five equals negative one over one hundred fifty u. So u equals what? U equals one fifty times thirty five. Ah, I used calculator. So five two five zero. Okay, determine the price per unit if six thousand unit. Are sold. That P 等于负一百五十乘以六千加六十，对不对？好了，负四十加六十 ，so equals twenty. So the price will be twenty dollars if the six thousand units has been sold. Okay. So the question part, the hardest part, Kevin, Kelvin, is you exactly know what is x, what is y. For this price is p equals whatever unit because the, the the they're related to each other. It's not u equals whatever m p plus b. Do you know why, Vicky? It's because unit is not determined. the 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 price determined by how many units is being sold. Me, my, my, Jason. Okay, so let's take a look at next one. Okay, 这个是我们这个这件就学的最重要的一个部分。Okay. Now let's take a look at. Ah,、uh, this is your today's home work because we're going to finish this part. Okay, this is our chapter review. Okay, Elaine, Jason, Vicky, ah, Vicky, 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 我刚才上课的时候也是这样，我这里多了一根，因为我自己剪，然后我刚才去剪掉了。你看，对，你看，我我妈剪头发剪的可丑了。不，你跟你妈说，下次就给她给你盖个碗在脸就头上，就哎碗。就是她她之前剪剪高了，剪到这儿了。对呀、啊，我我也不喜欢，你是不是也不喜欢把那个眉毛露出来？对对，我也是的。你看我这次也剪多了，头发长得很快。你看 Oliver 的头。他们竟然把名字改回来了！对呀、啊，他们多乖呀、啊！我跟他们说了呀
听过听话的。我不哦，幸是好好，小朋友，肯们定，我会们回我们去今用天。不会的，不会的。我们今天要把那个，就是这个部分一定要就是学的很仔细，很很认真，很知道在做什么。OK， <笑>一定要知道在做，因为我们这个 chapter 要 over 了。OK， 今天这个 chapter 要 over 了，所以非常重要。我们来看一下这个部分。OK， find the number n so that the line passing through the point、嗯、这个 has a slope of three。也就是说 ，m equals what equals three， right？ And also equals what equals n minus five over negative four minus negative three. Correct, Eli. So we have n minus five over negative four plus three. So equals n minus five over negative one. Now what's my plan? N minus five over negative one. Today five minus n. Do that. So if five n minus n equals three, equals n equals two. Very good, Jason. Good job. OK， 好，那我们每个小朋友来 ，Number eight，OK，Your、okay, turn Mm. Done. Okay, very good. I heard there are other people. Can you guys sleep? I want to know. No, but okay, someone did. Someone did. I think it's Jason. What? Why are you saying? I think it's Jason T something. Bro, stop copying my name. <laughs> <laughs> I can just copy your name. Do it. Hey. Hey. Okay.、Oh、so my line through point Y eight Y and two negative three has a slope parallel to a line with X intercept X three and Y intercept negative one. OK， 这什么意思啊？这题目感觉好复杂呀，我都不知道他在说啥，对不对？三位小三，你看了对不对？好了，这个的 parallel， 这个 line parallel to another line。好了 ，obviously this one has a variable， so we need to first find what find this line first， correct？ We need to find this line first， so how do we do it？ So 一条线。在 x 轴上嘛是一二三，跟三零点汇合 ；y 轴上嘛跟 negative one 汇合，是这么一条线。好，那我们是不是可以直接把这条线的 m 算出来？那这条线的 m 算出来，那就能把这条线的 m 是吧？反正跟它一样的，我只要等一下就行，对不对 ？So this one equals what? They go through three zero and zero negative one. Correct. 
So the mm. m of this one equals what? Equals zero minus negative one over three minus zero, which is one over three. Three. Well, that means for this one, they have the same slope. So for this x and y, so eight y and two negative three, they have the same slope of one over three. So y minus negative three over eight minus two equals one over three. Correct, Eli? So y plus three over six equals one over three. So what? Y plus three over six equals one over three. Correct? So three y equals negative three. Y equals negative one. Oliver, are you doing it? Okay, did you get everybody get the same answer like me? Yes. Okay, number 11. Number 11. Scary. This is similar. Yeah. Oh, yeah, similar. Sorry. Uh, can, can Sorry, number 12. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's wait, it's number 12. Yeah, it's number 12. Yeah, I think exactly the same. Oh, wait, never mind. It's... They almost are the same, Andy. Yeah. Keyword almost. I almost won a ten million dollar jackpot. I almost beat the e-car in a chess game. The word almost is really powerful. Are you talking? What's that voice? One over three. Out my eyes. Perpendicular, oh. Okay, C is equal to. When does everyone sleep in this class? Everyone. <laughs> what? I think... Just read my name, everyone. This message is directed towards you, that person behind that screen. Yes, I'm talking to you. <laughs> okay, oh so we can find out the slope of this one. So, uh, Kevin, no. Kelvin. 还有 Vicky 你看到没有老师都会做一个表 对,那你要自己会弄啊,对不对? So m1 times m2 equals negative 1. So 3 times negative 2 over c plus 2 equals negative 1. So negative 6 over c plus 2 equals negative 1. So c plus 2 equals 6, so c equals 4. Oh yeah, that makes sense. Here's 
Okay, so now let's take a look at. Uh, 哎，这个是你们比较差的。哎，这个是你们比较差。哎、yeah? ，What? 对对对，这个是太差了。Okay, number thirteen, everybody. Number thirteen. I don't like these questions. No one does. These questions are the definition of Minecraft ladder e double hockey sticks. Okay. Okay. One thousand for an hour. Expenses. Oh wait, never mind. Never mind. Two thousand. What is the domain、uh, name? Uh oh, I don't know what the domain name range is. No. Okay, so a television production company charges nineteen thousand for seven hours of work and fifteen thousand. He quoted me. 老师。嗯哼。Domain and range 是什么？忘啦、啊、，Yeah. Domain 是的 ，air 是这个 x 的取值范围 ，range 是这个 y 的取值范围。哦、uh, ，OK. Y starts at five thousand. X is two thousand、oh, yeah, per hour. Yeah, I forgot. 你们都忘啦、啊、？Yeah. yeah. Wait. So domain is five thousand, and range is two thousand. Wait. Which one is domain and which one is range? X. So domain is X. Domain is, is Y. Y. So do we just write five thousand for domain? I don't know. Thousand to infinite. Close. Okay, so everybody, I'm going to start to review the answer. Okay. Wait, so, television、okay. production company charged one night zero 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 for seven hours of work and fifteen thousand for the five hours of work. Find the hourly rate. How to do it,、uh, Oliver? The the hourly rate is like. Ah, 有些小朋友说，哎，我就除一除好了嘛。What? Oh, no, 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 no,
There is a fixed cost. Very good. Okay, so 19,000. If you have a Y oh, yeah. equals MX plus B, right? Oh, sorry. You don't, this is the next one. So the fixed cost equals, 19 equals fixed cost plus uh, 7X, correct? So one five zero zero. So this one, the fixed cost is B. So this X is M, correct? So seven M plus B equals nineteen, and five M plus B equals fifteen. Correct, everybody. So you can find out the B and find out the M. So everybody, could you please tell me what is M? What is B? Um, M is two thousand, and M B is five thousand. Okay, so let's see. What's the more What's the more I don't know. It's expensive. Yeah. Charges. <laughs> Everything people. gas prices these days. Back in my day, they only used to be. So 2,000 hour. 5,000. Correct, everybody? Right, like that. So this is the cost, this is hour, and that's the total. Correct? Okay, so what is a domain? So our, can we smaller than zero? No. No, it's yeah. 1来就要收钱的嘛, 对不对? 无论来, 来不来都要收钱, so H is bigger, sorry, bigger or equals to zero. That's a domain. Okay, so what is the range? The range is bigger or equals to 5,000. Because no matter how, understand, I saw Over. domain means range. No, domain means the x, the value. I just listed numbers. Okay, I'm not number list is like number two. Correct, everybody. Okay, so that's it. Okay, so we have some time to look at the same thing. Okay, so different forms of linear equations. Okay, so the linear equation could be something like that. Okay, so because before we only used that y equals mx plus b, right? So this is a linear. But we can also write it as mx plus b minus y equals zero, correct? We can also write it as mx minus y equals b, correct, everybody? So all of them are the same. They're just the different ways of doing that. Understand? So it doesn't matter. Kevin, Kelvin, Oh, y then you mx ya b to sh linear. Now mx is the and y then you b to push linear. No, they are just talking about the same thing. Understand? So that's the first thing, okay? So now we have another way of describing them is ax plus by equals c. Okay, so how to transfer this one into the way we're very familiar with? So we can have by equals c minus ax. So y equals negative a over bx plus c over b. This one is m, this one is b. Okay, everybody, could you please take your notes right now? Yeah, take your notes. Thank you. Yeah, Almost. Okay, so that means if I give you three X plus two B, sorry. <laughs> Three x plus two y equals four. So what is their m? What is their b? So because this is a, this is b, this is c, right? So you can see m equals negative a over b equals negative three over two. And b equals what? Equals c over b, which is four over two equals two. Get it, Doc? So with this method, you don't have to necessarily just to transfer them into the y equals mx plus b, that form. So this form is also okay. 
Okay, so I want you to write down. So with AX plus BY equals C, so M equals negative A over B and B equals C over B. Please write, okay? AX plus BY is equal to C. Okay, everybody, did you find out? Did you copy everything down already? I think I did. Okay, very good. So let's take a look at next one. Oh, okay, so everybody, let's go back to this one, okay? So I'm going to give you the equation 3x plus 2y equals 12. Everybody, please tell me, write the equation in slope intersection from the solving y. So we can have what? 2y equals 12 minus 3x. So y equals 6 minus 3 over 2x equals negative 3 over 2x plus 6. Okay, get it? Okay, so now because the B equals 6, we know Y must be go, sorry, this line must go through 0 and 6, correct? Graph another point. I can put another point as what? So the slope is negative three over two. And from zero six, we can go down by three unit and to the right by two unit to obtain three two. Kelvin, do you want to explain this method to all of us? You understand this method, correct? Yes. So, is a full sound over R. Ah. So are you talking to Kelvin or Kevin? Kelvin or Kevin do yeah, make them don't think now. Okay, you with Kevin, you with Kelvin, how we do a phone fire. That's how we do a phone fire. That's how you eat and you're the show with what? Kelvin, you're the show with what? Now, I should get you. She said, Wish him a touch of one shadow, Sanger, you would have to put them. Tell me, Elaine. Now, hold on. 然后下面是二,二是什么?二是positive的,那有些小朋友说老师,为什么在y的上面要走三,你记得吗?我们做slope的时候是不是y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1? Correct?所以说上面就是跟y有关系的,下面是跟x有关系的,所以你看到它的intercept是 negative 3 over 2,我就可以把它看成negative 3 over 2,其实还可以看成什么?3 over negative 2,其实也可以。那 three over negative two 是怎么样的？哎，那我就要往上面继续走了，就是这个零六，我往上走，一，一二三三格，然后呢，往左边走两个，一二，所以你看这个点是不是还在这个上
也可以的，知道吗 ？So when x the bottom denominator is negative, everybody, that means you're moving this dot from right to left. If the denominator is positive, you're moving the dot from right left to right. If the numerator is negative, that you're moving down, and if the numerator is positive, you're moving. Up. Understand, everybody? Okay, so I'm yes. going to quickly give you a thing to try. Okay, so let's see. So, 如果我知道有一个线 okay, so I have a one is y equals two three over two x minus four. 好了，小朋友们 ，Vicky， 你是不是马上知道这个这条线肯定过零一二三四？对不对？肯定过这个点，对不对？对不对？对。Let's go this one. Kevin, understand dot? Understand? Yeah, you're good. So zero and the negative four. Must go through this one. 好了，那另外一个点怎么办？那我们以前要怎么样？哎，当 y 等于零的时候嘛 ，x 当 x 等于零的时候 ，y 等于负四，那就 x 等于零的时候 ，y 等于多少？就很麻烦，对不对？但是我们现在可以用很快的方法。你看这个 slope 是不是 three over two? So that means for the y part, we need to move one, two, three. And for the x part, we need to move one, two. So this one, which is two and negative one, is another dot to go through this one. So all we need to do is just to connect these two. Okay. Get it, everybody? Okay, so dot. It's not going to be relevant for every single question when it is not hard. But when you try to find another pair of dot, it's really helpful. Do that. Okay. So now I'm going to give you some questions to practice. Okay. Y equals four x minus three. Y equals three over eight x plus two. Y equals negative two over five x minus minus one. Okay, everybody, please give me pair of the dot. 你看这个很简单，对不对？这个是什么？是不是可以有零和负三？对不对？好了，自己马上给我啊，发发消息给我，把那个 chat 发给我。Are you doing the first one? 三个都要做。Okay. What? So do we just find another point? So do we find the uh, uh, x intersection? 没有啊，我要你用那个方法就找出来两个 points 嘛。不要用，不要用，不要用 x intersection 做。任任何任何任何一个 point 都可以。对呀、啊，对呀、啊，对呀、啊。嗯。It shows the only. This is so cool. I agree. Starting at the moment. 老师，我是不是很聪明？我怎我都没法回答你这种问题。
，嘻嘻嘻。对呀、啊，你不能说我错的，这答案是对的。我觉得你是算聪明的。我 have to， 我 have to admit it。那小朋友们好，有些小朋友说老师这道题目没法做啊，然后我说为什么没法做？那老师，你看你以前都是有一个 denominator， 有个 numerator。我知道 denominator 上的数呢是 x 在 y 轴上啊 ，denominator 是 y 轴上移来移去 ，denominator 是在 x 轴上移移来移去。现在都没有，那你看4是不是就等于 four over one， 对不对？那你现在有一个 03， 对不对？ 0负3是不是在这？好了，那你看 y 轴上是不是往上移？一二三四，那是不是就是负三加四，是不是等于一？好了，那 x 轴呢？ x 轴要往正的移。好了，就是一和一。模。好了呀，对不对？好了，那这个下面一个呢？我知道肯定有零和二，对不对？那这个怎么办？ numer <笑> denominator 这个上面的就直接二，二加三，对不对？等于五。然后这个呢？八，那就是 eight。I am crazy. 快不快 ？OK， 好，下面一个负一，对不对？负一和零，对不对？那你看你这里有负二和五，对不对？好了，那就是什么？负一减二，对不对？那就是负三。What? OK， 下面呢？零，那就直接放五。好了，五和负三完了。看到了吗？如果你们要移来移去的话，啊，当然你说，哎 ，Kevin 说，我老师我就喜欢 x intersection， 可以啊，当零，哎 ，y 等于零的时候，负二分之五 x 减一，对不对？然后这是一等于负的二分之五 x， 所以 x 等于 negative five over two， so negative five over two and zero it is n。那你说你算这个比较容易错，还是像我这样子加加减减比较容易错？当然是这个比较不不容易错。我已经懂不懂这个方法？是不是 ？Dot， 对，看你看 ，Dot，Dot， 那我再我再来一遍，我再来一遍啊！我随便出一个题 ，y 等于负八 over three x 加一 ，OK？ Zero one three negative seven. So I'm going to think it's negative eight. Sorry, I'm not going to put negative eight because that's easy because this one's zero. So we put Eight and negative three, so that's m. This is moving on the y slot, so y is now one. That this plus eight is nine, it becomes nine, right? That x is plus three, zero plus three is nine, or plus three. Okay, plus three. Wait, what? Oh wait, oh yeah, right. You wait, what? Uh、mm、huh. -hmm. Quick. That's the quickest. Then, then you you're only supposed to oh, you're only supposed to minus though. No, minus which one? It's always plus. Wait, oh wait. You put the oh my bad. 再来一遍啊！我再来一遍啊！啊，叶磊，你给我出道题。Y 等于什么 ？Seven. Uh, y equals one hundred x plus one thousand. Fast. Okay. <laughs> So immediately, dot. You can write zero one thousand. Zero one thousand. 对不对？好了，这个最容易，一百就是一百 over one。上面是 y 的，下面是 x 的。好了 ，y 加 y 等于一千一百。x 呢，零加一等于。Oh, we still follow the same formula. Yeah, just a plus. How quick it is! 我才不愿意算呢，我最懒了。你看，因为给你的题目太简单了，我要来一个分数的，负三分之十二不行，三分之十三，加上。对我这已经很好了，我后面不给你们分数，好不好？加上五 ，OK， 好，马上给我。Would it be negative thirteen? Zero five, 对不对？好了， yeah. 然后呢 ？Three over negative thirteen， 为什么？ Negative、因为这个地方，这个地方加，如果我 negative thirteen， negative three plus five 就比较容易错，三加五不会有人错的，等于八。另外一个呢，零加负十三还是负十三，也不会有人错，负十三和八。好Kevin, Kevin, 对不对？这样是不是最快的？最快最快的方法，不会错的。Wait, will the second number still have that like negative thing from the first equation that we used to do? Which one? 
like the slope one, like y minus y two and then x minus more y x two. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's why. So you need to add some more. Because you now know the answer. You just so m m equals y one minus y two, right? Over x one minus x two. It doesn't matter. Okay. 好了，你现在已经知道 m 是什么了，是不是？这个 m 上面的这个数就是，比如说 m 是二 over 五，对不对？那这个二是不是就是 y 一减 y 二了？那你知道其中一个 y 一了，你是不是把 y 二加上去，不就是得到 y 一 ？You don't know y one, you only know y two. So y two plus this two equals y one. So that's why it's always plus. Get it? So everybody, let's try another one, last one. Okay, y equals negative one over. Sorry, four over fifteen x plus fifteen. 好了，快用 chat 发给我。Okay. No, no intersections. Shit, I messed up. 零和二啊，可以吗？对啊，四 over negative fifteen 啊，所以是 negative fifteen and six。好了呀。哦、oh, ， that's so easy。对不对啊？你看快不快啦？ Dot 看到没有？快不快啦？懂不懂？是不是很快？对不对？嗯哼。嗯。Mm -hmm. Okay, we're going to look at point to slope uh, form of a linear equation, okay? This is just like the same thing, right? M is y 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 equals 3 over 2x minus 3. So the slope is 3 over 2. y intersection is 0, negative 3. Get it? 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 Get 那你会背下来。如果你背下来这个，那你直接可以做，前面都不用做。Negative three over negative two equals three over two, and this one six over negative two equals negative three. Get done. 是不是？你要不然就背公式，要不然就自己推。That's the same thing. OK. 那我的意思呢？你们一半的题目 ，half of the question 用背公式做 ，half of them 用自己推做。哎，这样两种方法都掌握了。Got on the same. OK. 推嘛，我不是推给你看了吗？四加三 y 等于十二，三 y 等于十二减四 x， 所以 y 等于四减去 four over three x， so slope equals negative four over three， so y intersection is zero four， 对不对？这个就自己推理出来的。So you get the answer by step by step， or you can just by memorize the 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 equation. So a b c. So for the slope is negative a over b. Which is negative two over five, so positive. Okay. Right. So y slope is c over b, which is negative seven over negative five equals seven over five. 也马上能出来。Okay. Okay. 那我就跟你们说，你们两种方法都要学会，对不对？那么两种方法自己各自推一遍，好不好 ？Okay. 好了，下面 rewrite the slope equation into the standard form. 那什么叫 standard form? Standard form 就是 a x plus b x b y equals c， 对不对？那这个怎么办嘛？咱们全都放到现在放到一起了，是不是对？就是 two x plus y equals one， 对不对？那这个呢？就是 three negative three x plus y equals zero。那这个呢？这个就是 negative three over four x plus y equals five。Get it? Understand, everybody? So that's a standard form, okay? So rewrite the point-slope equation in the slope intersection. Ah, I'm coming out of this voice. You guys, no one has 
觉得我在发神经病吗？因为我也发这种声音啊。<笑> point slope 是怎么样的 ？Point slope 就是你看，当 y 等于二的时候 ，x 是不是等于负一？对不对？啊，那 e l a i n 你再找一个点出来，对不对？啊，这两个点出来，对就可以了，好不好？<笑>今天这个部分不是很难啊，我只要求你们学会刚才那个我移来移去的那个东西，就会做就行了。OK， 然后呢，我们要把今天的这个 chapter review， 一共三页纸、四页纸，大部分难的已经都过过了。这个限时四十五分钟做完。啊、oh, ，sorry， 四十五分钟有点有点短，算了，六十分钟好吧，六十分钟把这套题目做完，等一下我会给你看的，呀，好吧 ，dot 明白了吗 ？dot，OK，、okay. 六十分钟这个是要做完的 ，Kevin 知道了吗 ？Kevin，Kevin 知道了吗 ？OK， 要做完的啊，呃，这个这一章我们就过去了，因为这个也是我们在呃。Grade ten 这个里面，这个就是 pre calculus 里面非常重要的一部分。OK， 因为因为其实大家都觉得啊，三角函数难，我觉得三角函数其实不难的，啊，这个部分比较重要。OK， 呃，这个这个这个这个 Oliver 和 Elaine， 还有 Kelvin 好像都学过一点这个三角函数了，对吧 ？Kelvin 也学过一点。嗯，我忘了。呃、uh, ，trigonometry。Oh yeah。但我教你们过的嘛，对吧？对，但是。Yeah. 时间长了，可能又忘了，对不对 ？Not really. Remember a bit. A bit, yes. It's、well, okay. Sign, not sin. 对，对对对，那个 sign 是 sign， 不是不是不是 cos， 是 cosine， 不是 cos。Cos。老师，老师，老师。啊、uh -huh.。我们三角函数不是学过了吗？这个这个班。对啊，就学了一点啊，但是学的不是很扎实呀，还要在那个呀，这个又忘了呀，你们又忘了呀。我就知道，反正肯定大部分人又忘了。反正我我跟你讲啊，我也不说什么，我给你拿三道题，你要是都会做，我们可以不学，对不对？但是我我估计你肯定不行的。OK， 因为你的脑子有一点像 fish。我。呀，你看 Kevin， 你看 Kevin，Kevin， 你这里怎么长了个东西啊？我这里弄破了。啊，疼不疼啊？ Rip. 哎哎 ，Jason， 我跟你说个事情啊，你可以头发给我剪一剪了，你看看你的头发长的，你把头发弄下来，那你,你这样我不知道你在说什么。<笑>你把头发这样弄下来，这样这样这样这样，让我看看多长。哎呦哎呦哎呦，哦哦，好帅好帅！我们这里头发符合标准的是 Kevin、Dot 还可以的 ，Oliver 们有点乱七八糟，有点像狗啃。<笑> Oliver 和那个 Andy 都有点像狗啃的，真是。<笑> Okay, so that's it for today's class. Okay, so 我会把这个卷子每个小朋友六十分钟完成，好不好？要六十分钟完成啊。Okay, that's it. Okay, bye bye.